Hi, it's your coach Joe Lucas. Welcome to your practice power daily power man. Welcome to Tuesday. Welcome to the 27th of November. Hey, just a just a quick reminder as we kind of get into our December calendar in just a few days, and before we know it, the end of the year is going to be here. That you know you're coming into December probably in a couple different scenarios. Scenario number one, you've had a great year. We're in good shape. We're thinking about next year, working on your business plan, wrapping up some things uh, for 2012. And congratulations, that's great. Scenario number two is you're kind of on the bubble. You got to push it a little bit, but you're still in pretty good shape. Um, probably make most of your goals. Maybe not make all of them, but overall, you'll consider 2012 to be a successful year. Your growth. Third element is you know what? It was not a great year, and we didn't hit our goals. And it's sort of we're in. We're looking at 2013 and wait to next year and let's make things happen. Let me say this about any one of these three scenarios. That at the end of the day, this is still I have a business of what? Habits, beliefs, and behaviors. The, the worst thing you can do is come into December saying, well, I'm just going to come in and kind of get some things done and kind of hang out and, and you know, kind of relax our standards. You start relaxing your standards, you're going to sabotage yourself next year. And by the way, I see this happen all the time in this industry for over 20 years. Is, you know, producers or advisors get in this mode of, can't wait till next year, wait till next year. And then they don't do what's necessary in the month of December. And look, December is a short month. You know, well, again, whether you're going to work till the holidays, work a little bit through the holidays, whatever you decide to do, that's obviously your decision. But remember this, there's a lag between activity and result. So if you're looking to have a good January and get out and get out of the box really strong next year, right, and really kind of move things along, get momentum, well, a lot of what happens in January is going to be your December behaviors. Even if you can't schedule people because they say, I don't want to deal with anything until after the holidays, you get them in your January calendar now. You create that momentum. You create that full kind of what do most producers do. They wait till after the holidays and they start calling people and then there's a week or two lag in getting them in and then they have to think about it. And the next thing we know, are, you know, we don't have a great January. So your January starts now. So I want you to think about it that way. The second thing I want you to think about is you're going to want to make some changes in 2013 because we all do. Don't wait to make those changes in your habits January 1st. Think of December sort of whatever whatever terminology like preseason, spring training, uh, testing grounds, whatever it is. Change your behaviors now so you have momentum for 2013, okay? Have a great day today. And don't forget, make sure you decide how you want to deal with your business planning. Our business planning center is open, and I'll see you tomorrow.